Today we're going to be looking at the Azores Wi-Fi extender. This is what the box looks like. This is like a little detail of what I'll be unboxing. There's the logo, the back of it, and now let's unbox it. When you open it, there's a manual and then the plugs for the extender. Getting it out of the box, this is what the extender looks like. It feels a bit light, and the design is really nice, but also really simple. And then back here is where you're going to be plugging it in. So now let's go set it up. So I set up the extender right next to the main router. This is really what it looks like. At the bottom, there is a blinking light. So this is what it looks like when you turn off the lights. So it's not really that bright. So if it's in your room and you're trying to sleep, it's not going to wake you up. Now let's see how it is with the internet and if it really helps or if it really just does nothing. So for me to test out the internet, I'm actually going to test it out on my PS4. Um, the games I play, they can run really slow. So I'm going to see if the Wi-Fi is faster on it and if I can actually play the games better. And I just did a test on my internet. So hopefully it runs a bit faster. I'm gonna load into a game and see if it really does and then I'll give my thoughts of it. Okay so I'm on Battlefront with a friend and usually if your internet's bad, in the corner it'd show like a sign and I get that a lot, but I've been playing for about 30 minutes now and it's running a lot smoother and faster. So I think the extender is really helping. So overall this Wi-Fi extender is really nice and it makes my games run a lot smoother. So I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. If you